Greetings and salivations everyone. I'm Krista. This is Fisher and welcome to Sea Rad. Today I wanted to share with you the Grogu items that I got for Christmas. So stay tuned. Sea Rad. Hi everybody. Well, hello, hello, hello everyone. Welcome. We hope everyone's doing totally rad today. Yes, Christmas has come and gone and believe it or not, Conrad got me some Grogu things that I did not have. Now, granted, some of these items have been on my wish list for a while now, but they're things that I just never actually bought myself. So I thought I'd show everything to you, give them a little quick review, and rate everything on our scale of totally bad to totally rad. So Fisher, I'm going to have to dig in my bag over here to get the items, so I'm going to put you to the side for a little bit. Are you good with that? I'm good with that. All right, little dude. Boop. We will see you in a little bit. So as I mentioned, a couple of the items were on my Amazon wish list. He got everything from Amazon. So of course I will put links to everything in the description of the video for you. And a couple of the items were not on my wish list. So it was nice to get a couple of fun surprises. The first item was actually one that's been on my wish list for a while. And I've seen pictures of it, but I've never, of course, seen it up close and in person. And it's this necklace, guys. I know some of you have seen this before some of you may even have it but it's a little moon and then it's got a little circular in there that has Grogu inside it's super cute and adorable the chain is a little cheap and it looks like it's a little short I don't like necklaces that choke me you know that I don't like collars that choke me I don't like necklaces that choke me but I have some longer chains where I can actually change that it is a big enough little area there where I can get a different chain through it and get this one off but let me just put the chain on that comes with it so you guys can get an idea of how long it actually is now this actually isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. That kind of hits in a good spot. It's not actually choking me. I, I think it's really pretty and maybe I'll leave it on here for a little while. I don't wear necklaces that often, but I think I might actually wear this one from time to time because it's really, really super cute. This is about $10 on Amazon, so it's not high-end jewelry. It's just a cute little costume piece. Rating it on our scale of totally bad to totally rad. It's a totally rad because the chain's a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. And it, it looks really nice with my new shirt. What do you think, guys? Do you like it? So, yeah, I'm going to call it a totally rad. And again, link to it will be in the description of the video for you. The next item is another piece of jewelry. And we all know I love bracelets. Right, guys? This one wasn't on my Amazon wish list, even though I had seen it before. I don't know why I never put it on there. But it's a cute little Grogu in the center holding a heart. And it's like that kind of faux leather bracelet. And it's got just fake silver beads around the side. I will say this is not a high-end piece of jewelry either, but that's okay. It's super cute. And it's adjustable. And just fits right on. And then you pull the strings closed. Quality-wise, it seems to be put together really well, so I'm actually going to probably start wearing this one every day. I wear two other bracelets every day, so this might go into my everyday wear, and I will hopefully be able to update you and say, yes, it's lasting, or no, it didn't last really long. Hopefully the first, not the second. But super cute, fits really great. I'll leave it on here while I'm talking, see if it stays comfortable, and yeah, remind me, and if I didn't update you by the end of this video, how it felt, if it was annoying, or it kind of moved good with my arm, remind me, and I'll let you know in the comments. But Super cute. He did really well on the cute jewelry. The next Grogu item is just a towel. I needed a new bathroom towel. I use my other Grogu towel in the bathroom for my hair or when I wash my face at night to just dry my face off. So it's cute little Grogu with Mando. It says Star Wars on it. It's, it's a thinner towel. It's not super, super soft. I'm going to have to wash it. I'm sure once it's washed, it's going to soften up just like my other one did. The other one wasn't real soft to begin with either, but look at his face, guys. <laughs> He's cute. It says super soft on the tag, but again, yeah, it's going to need a wash to kind of loosen it up and get it super soft. And then, yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. 
Rating this one on a scale of totally bad to totally rad. It's a totally rad. Uh, you know what? All of these items are probably going to be totally rads because they were gifts and I love them. But you know me. I'm honest. If I just thought it was just kind of eh, I would tell you that. But great use for a towel. It is a beach towel. So if you're going to the beach or the pool in the next, what, five months or so. Oh, come on, winter. Get over. But it would be cute for that use as well. Oh, and I forgot to rate the bracelet, guys. The bracelet's definitely a totally rad because it's so super cute. I love that it's got a little heart because Grogu loves me and Conrad loves me. The next item is something that's been on my wish list just because I think it's really, really funny. It's a little tin sign. Flush, you must. <laughs> it's so funny. We have a running thing in our house that Grogu and the pram, like all the pictures of him, look like Grogu on the toilet. Well, now we actually have a picture of Grogu on a toilet. And look how funny. He kind of reminds me, it reminds me of Chip on the toilet. What do you guys think? Does that remind you guys of Chip? <laughs> so funny. <laughs> I love it. But it's just a tin sign. It's about an 8x10, 8x12, and there's other Star Wars ones, so I'm going to have to go check those out on Amazon and see if they have others of those, and then we can kind of put them in the bathroom and decorate that way. He's cute. He's definitely going in my bathroom. And rating this one on our scale of totally bad to totally rad, he's a beyond totally rad, guys, just because, yep. Chip on the toilet. So funny. Flush you must. Yes, definitely. But speaking of the bathroom, we had kind of a bathroom theme going with my gifts this year. Check this out, guys. I got a bathroom rug. We have been using a towel on our floor outside our bathroom. Our bathroom was redone within the last year, so it's nice to finally have an actual bath mat on the floor. We had an older cat who, if you left a bath mat down, yes, he would do his business on the bath mat, unfortunately. But now he is gone. It's sad sad rest in peace mr kitty but now we can have a bath mat on the floor it's, it's been a few months since he's passed and we've got the new kittens and yes it's just been a weird weird year guys but love the bath mat it is definitely a totally rad it's a great size and it fits perfectly in our bathroom and it's just super super cute just something we noticed on this though look it's flammable and it fails to meet the U.S. Department of Commerce standards and should not be near sources of ignition. So, just a little warning on that for you. And the last item, guys. This one I have not even seen on Amazon. I don't know how we found them because you guys know I search and search and search. I go through pages and pages every morning looking for new Grogu stuff. But he found me pajama pants. How super adorable are these? They are pajammy jammy pants, and they've got my favorite little cartoon Grogu on them with little hearts. I know there's a Loungefly bag and wallet with this on it as well, so I love this pattern. I'm actually thinking of getting the wallet because it's been on sale recently. But these are very super light, very thin. They actually run a little bit big, but I like my pants big and baggy anyway, so that's not, that's not a bother for me at all. And I know I haven't been telling you prices because I'm going to have to go look everything up because they were Christmas gifts, so I'm not really, really sure of all the prices of them. So if I find prices, I'll put them down on each of the items as I'm talking about them. But these guys on our scale of totally bad to totally rad, these are definitely a beyond totally rad just because, yes, my favorite Grogu on some really comfy and really cute sleepy pants. So that's not everything that I got for Christmas, but it is everything Grogu wise that I got. I it, It's hard to buy me Grogu stuff because I'm buying stuff throughout the year for the channel and to review for you guys. But I was pleasantly surprised that he did not get me one thing that I already had. So great job, Conrad. Love it. Love that he came and did the Christmas video with us. And I'm hoping to, you know, kind of convince him to come on the channel a little bit more in 2023 what do you guys think let him know in the comments if you want to see more conrad i know i said that last year and it didn't happen too much but fingers crossed guys we, you can always hope right <laughs> but in the meantime
time. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more awesome and totally rad things in the future, please subscribe to our channel and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss seeing us. And I guess there's only one thing left to say, right cutie little pants? We'll see you later.